Morning, Piggy. Morning, morning. Another Piggy day along the Piggy way. All right, folks, you probably be hearing stuff from both of us this morning. Uh, it's got day. Uh, I spent quite, spent quite a bit of time on video messenger video call last night with somebody. Three hours, a little over three hours. And, uh, well, I wasn't going to say how much time. <laughs> yeah, we had a great conversation, but the reason for the conversation is what uh, disturbs me. Uh, y'all, Miss Linda Peterson, y'all know her. She's sweet as she can be. YouTube giving her a hard time again, accusing her of being a spammer. And here's the odd thing. Seems to happen every time after she mentions mine and Elaine's channels. Folks, that means there's somebody reporting Ms. Linda's comments. Uh, and when it's after she's mentioned our channels, that means there's somebody out there who has something against us. Maybe against Miss Linda too for mentioning us. Now that gives me suspicions on who it might be, because that, uh, on what I could think of, that might have a uh, vindictive bone and want to cause us trouble by causing Miss Linda trouble. Now I can't say who it is, because I don't know. I can suspect, based off of presumptions of tidbits of this and that and, you know, two plus two, you know, but when cowards do things, you know, them people with big yellow streaks down their backs ain't got the intestinal fortitude. Uh, just come right out with it and confront and ask if you got a problem with them or not and do things in a cowardly way like that to cause others problems you know well I've done seen a few done got them pegged as to who, who and how they are but whoever's doing that, you're a coward. And I'm just going to put it that way. And I'm going to ask folks to start paying attention to see if they can see any telltale hints of anybody <clears throat> being untoward to somebody else. See if we, maybe we can figure out who this coward is. Because Miss Linda is as sweet as they come. Miss Linda supports so many people by commenting, liking, watching their videos, being in their live streams. You know, nudging people to like, subscribe, and share, and comment, and all that. Yeah. You know, folks, y'all don't know how much that means to a channel to have somebody, you know, basically being a cheerleader, cheering them on. You know, that's good as money. Personally, I see it this way. If you don't like my channel, you don't like Piggy's channel, fine. Don't watch them. If, if you don't like somebody shouting us out, leave a comment. Tell them. Say, hey, we wouldn't shout them out so much. You know, or just overlook it. In other words, grow a pair. Yeah. You know, because uh, Miss Linda supports a lot. I do mean a lot of channels. By yeah. doing what she does. This is her way of being able to socialize. She's being threatened with possibility of having you. She's been, I've been told that uh, she's threatened with having a lot of her comments taken down. 
and the possibility of having her channel taken down by YouTube because of some little weasel that's too cowardly to actually say what's on their mind. Yeah. You know, now a lot of times I talk about things in generalizations, but sometimes, you know, most of the time there is one spark that causes that generalization to come up. And, uh, in videos, we have noticed that uh, that person, uh, there's a person that has knee-jerked by using some of the words we've used in our videos to describe what we're talking about on those generalizations. Well, I'm just going to put this. If the shoe fits, wear it. Because when I talk about it, there's more than one channel that I'm talking about. Yeah, we got a few of them we've seen. There, there's several that I've seen that do a lot of the same things and cause a lot of the same things I'm talking about. But like she said, if the shoe fits, lace that bitty up and wear it, Bubby. That's it. Because it's just the truth. Uh, yeah, I, I, I'm going to talk about something else too uh, what is a hater a hater is somebody that hates on people on YouTube or any, anywhere else in life because they ain't doing as good as that other one is and they just can't stand it so they hate on them and leave all sorts of disparaging comments and everything and all like that you know, oh y'all ain't no good oh y'all ain't really y'all ain't this y'all ain't that that's a hater folks uh -huh. but somebody that's calling you out on how you actually are that's not a hater that's somebody telling you straight up what the facts of life are uh -huh. there is a difference and uh, we, we've noticed some of that you know, and I, got, I, I have a very uh, high suspicion that one of those examples is what's behind doing this. Because I, I'm just going to tell you, you know, Linda's had her channel for quite a while, and she does it, you know, so that young ones in her family can come to know who she is by being able to see her on YouTube. And, uh, you know, but because of somebody's pettiness, you know, it, awful funny, she's had no problems up until Elena, Elena and I made a couple of videos uh, talking about uh, situation in generalized ways about drama about drama and boom Linda got hit took something uh, a comment she made she told me what the comment was I understood real quick you know well somebody took her comment with their mind went straight to the gutter with it so I, you know, I figured, well, that's just you two, you know, not knowing what they talked about, went straight to the gutter with something and hit it. Well, now, it's happening and her being called a spammer by you two. And it happens after she mentions mine and Aline's channels. Doesn't matter whose channel she comments on as far as their videos or whatever. Their lives. Their lives. Videos, whatever. She mentions us. She gets hit by YouTube. Folks, that's somebody reporting her. Yes. It's petty. It's cowardice. Yo. I wish whoever's got that yellow streak going down there back to size of Mississippi get over themselves and just come out with it because 
you know, I'll face you. Whoever it is, I'll face you. And if you'll get the, uh, grow a pair and get the intestinal fortitude to pipe up and talk, I'll tell you. And I'll tell you like it is. <clears throat> you know, But going after somebody like Miss Linda, because they mention us, that means that somebody is basically trying to come at us in a sideways manner. And that means you're a criminal, you're a narcissist, and you've been exposed. So, at least you feel like you've been exposed because you heard that the shoe fit, you need jerk to reveal yourself even though you don't realize it. And, uh, you know, or you may just be thinking all that. Uh, and it hasn't been, you know, that hasn't happened, but you feel like it has, so you feel like you gotta retaliate, whoever you are. You know? But uh, grow a pair, face me. Get it resolved. And I'll tell you like it is. You know? Because you coming after Miss Linda, you're coming after a huge supporter of I don't know how many tens or hundreds of channels that she watches, keeps track of. Miss Linda keeps track of not only the homesteading community, but a lot of the fishing community and, uh, and, and cooking. And others. Yeah, and others. I mean, it's just, I've seen her in so many different lives. I'm like, wow, I didn't realize she was, you know. <laughs> She's really, everywhere. She's she, everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> Out there supporting channels, encouraging folks to like, share, subscribe. You know, uh, it, it, it it's hard to get support like that. Yeah. But she enjoys it. That's her way of being able to socialize. Like us, that's uh, this YouTube family thing is is her family yeah you know and uh, the way she gets to be like us the way she gets to be able to have a good time and get around so to speak yeah can't do it physically but we got internet and digital and got all these nice ways of being able to communicate and all like that and that's what she does you know and we do too well, I'm like this about it. If you want, if you think I have a problem with you, if you think Piggy has a problem with you, speak up, ask us about it. And if you don't want to put it out on the video or or put a comment on the video about asking us about it, if it's about you, hey, we got emails linked to the channels. Send an email. Right. Because, uh... And, you know... If it is specific ones, and trust me, others have let us know they've seen it too. They just didn't want to say nothing. Yeah, we ain't into creating drama. Because we ain't into creating drama. But, you know, I don't care about me. Don't like me. Uh, you know, you want to do things, you know, and all like that. That's fine. You come after people like Miss Linda. Miss Linda is just one. She is the example of what the support of our YouTube channels are. She is the watcher. She is the one that watches the videos. She is the one that shares out the videos. She is the one that likes the videos, comments on the videos. She is the one that helps. And she's helps. the one that a lot of times makes it very light and jovial in there because she's all the time laughing and giggling about stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And, and like I said, she's just the example of, of, of that. There, you know, she she and others like her are what makes our channels because without them, 
we don't have channels. That's it. If they, if they ain't uh, watching, you know, you don't have a channel. Yeah. And it's like uh, one big channel I watch, Chick Canick. Yeah. She done videos on some stuff that her Who Sparta does, and somebody at Who Sparta watches her videos, and he suggested to the higher ups that they have her come to the expo they just had, for all the different uh, makers of lawn equipment and chainsaws and stuff come to, and the CEO of Who Sparta also encouraged her to be there so that he and his design teams, the high ups and design teams and all like that could speak with her and she put it like this she said without y'all the viewers I wouldn't have had all that information to put out on a video and this would never have happened the viewers make it mm -hmm. you know without the viewers you know and hear somebody being petty going to report somebody because they got their well feelings hot you know I'm sorry you're a child well no you're an adult that means the folks bottom line is that kind of behavior is criminal behavior that's what criminals do that's what narcissists do. Narcissists are criminals. But they just ain't been caught. You know, so throw up here, talk to me. Get it resolved. And leave Miss Linda alone. Let's see it right there. Leave her alone. Alright. Peggy loves you.